Heavy winds, flash floods, and tons of rain up and down the Gulf Coast as Gordon makes landfall. Good evening, I'm Kevin Kelly. This is the scene in Dauphin Island, Alabama, when the storm hit. But tonight, happy to report, Gordon is losing steam. It's now a tropical depression. The storm, however, is expected to enter southern Arkansas late tonight and continue its way north tomorrow. Of course, Chief Meteorologist Jeff Baskin following that action for us very closely. We'll check in with him in just a minute. But in the meantime, Fox 16's Mitch McCoy, a very busy man. He's been following the storm all day long. He has more from us tonight from Lake Village, Arkansas, which is in Chico County. Boy, whether you're on the Arkansas side or the Mississippi side of the Mississippi River, uh, everybody's really going to be feeling the effects of Tropical Depression Gordon. I spent uh, most of my day over on the Mississippi side watching as Gordon affect uh, folks over there in Mississippi, specifically Leland and Cleveland. They have been uh, really ready for this and they've been pr preparing for days. They say Arkansans should be too. One minute it's pouring, the next blue skies. It's Mother Nature's way of telling you she's in charge. Oh yes, I'm very concerned, you know. It's... Harold Norrells lives in Leland, Mississippi. He just stocked up on sandbags before Gordon makes his mark. In this area, it'll flood pretty much, you know, if you're not careful. But most of all, I'm just being more cautious at this time. That rain is on and off throughout the day, but the wind is constantly moving. Take a look at this wooden side right behind me. It's being chucked through the wind, and that American flag above it is being whipped at nearly 30 miles an hour. We have to close down early so we can prepare. Debbie Mitchell owns a salon in Leland. She says businesses, including hers, and schools closed early Wednesday. They close down and get home for shelter. I mean, it's basically nothing else that you can do in a time like this here when the flood is coming. As rain comes and goes, people like Harold are hoping for Mother Nature's grace. I just pray. I just pray and ask God, you know, to bypass all the troubles. 